YouTubers and welcome back to the Deals Pro Energy channel. This is part two review of the i5 Mini 3 tablet PC. It's a 7.85 inch IPS screen tablet running on a rock chip uh, RK3188 1.6 gigahertz CPU Android 4.2.2 Jelly Bean and uh, in this review we're just going to do a live Antutu benchmark test. We're going to actually download Antutu right now So uh, actually while we're doing, while we're downloading this, you can take this time to like our video. Also, subscribe to our YouTube channel. And uh, there's actually a product link in our YouTube video description. We just did an in-depth, all-in-one review. Um, unboxing, showed you the ports, the accessories, the free YouTube promo gift. Show you the icons, the pre installed apps, did some web browsing, all in part one. So, all in one review. And uh, this is part two, this is the live review. It should take about four to five minutes. So, uh, you guys can just maybe grab a bag of popcorn and uh, click on the, on the link to our site and uh, check out some of the specs and depth. So, uh, this is uh, Antutu Benchmark 4. And uh, it's a lot more uh, thorough than the previous ones, than the version 3. So we're going to test all these different things. And uh, here we go. So this is an ultra slim device. Uh, it has uh, dual, dual cameras, camera on the front, camera on the back. Again, we showed you uh, that in uh, part 1 review. You can just do a search on our on our YouTube channel for uh, Mini 3 or again just click to our uh, product page the both videos will be embedded there and it has micro HDMI um, Bluetooth it has a 4100 milliamp battery for three to six hours of uh, usage ultra light only 290 grams this is the black version and uh, one gigabyte RAM, 16 gigabyte ROM, and the screen is uh, pic again a 7.85 inch, and it's 1024 by 768 pixel resolution. So we're just about halfway uh, finished with this, uh, with this uh, test. Seven percent, and it keeps on asking us this, but no. So it's just testing the multitask performance right now. Just to remind you that uh, when you order, uh, remember in the order notes section to ask us for the free gift. In order to find out what that free gift is, though, you're gonna have to watch part one. This is the all-in-one in-depth review. <clears throat> so I, I have a good feeling that this tablet is going to get a, a nice, respectable score. How you know the number? I can't really tell, but uh, we'll have to see. See, there's. It supports YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, MSN, Skype, Video Chat, Google Mail, Google Maps, G um, Play Store. Ninety-three percent. So it's a uh, ten seconds. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay, so our device ranks right here. Above the Google Nexus 10. Let's just check out test. So, wow, it gets so 19,506. Let's check out the details there. So, I'll bring this, the screen up and uh, you can pause the screen because uh, 
composite there and just get all the uh, details. Okay, so it, it does it is 1.6 gigahertz. And now let's uh, go to device info and again we'll just pause the screen because there's a lot of info to read through. So you can pause the screen there. Looks like we're getting down to here, the 1.6 gigahertz, so we'll scroll up a little bit more. And uh, you can pause the screen now. And uh, there's the version that was last updated on August 29th. And then uh, the rest of it, you can uh, pause the screen now. And uh, is that device info? Okay. So yeah, this just about uh, concludes this uh, Live Antutu benchmark test. Make sure to check out uh, the All-in-One review in part one. We show you the free YouTube promo, uh, promo gift. There's a product link in our uh, video description. Okay, folks, uh, thanks for watching, and uh, we'll see you next time.